Oh, hello there once again. Jeffrey Raccoon here for you. Just to brighten your day with a little something. And I'm going to let you know. I did that earlier little mo little video about Jonathan McIntosh. Well, I'm about tired of people like him. Preaching to me on how I'm supposed to behave. How you're supposed to behave. Now I'm supposed to behave. How we behave is none of his business. These self-appointed gurus and, and authority figures are not authority figures, and they have no business telling either you or I how to behave in, in polite society. They don't like the way somebody does something. Don't hang around them. I wouldn't hang around a poor dork like, like Jonathan McIntosh. He came near me, I told him to go away, leave me alone. I'd probably call the cops on him. They ain't harassing me. But the, the point is that he, they think that if you don't magically agree with them, you're some sort of evil dragon that has to be slain. Well, you're not a white knight. You're the court jester. You're the, you're the king's fool. In your case, you were the queen's fool because you worked for Anita Sarkeesian. She... She, uh, she kind of fancies herself this queen of political correctness and how to tell you and I how to live. Well, she doesn't know. She doesn't know. You don't know. Kevin Michael Kidrell doesn't know. I mean, that guy that calls himself Copper Cab. All these... All these... Anita Sarkeesian definitely doesn't know because she's... If I mentioned her already, sorry, slipped my mind, but all these guys think they know what's good for us because one size doesn't fit all. Everybody's different. That's what they they don't get. They try to make everybody fit into a their round hole when there's octagon pegs, square pegs, there's all sorts of shapes and pegs. There's hexagon pegs. You're not going to fit every peg into a round hole. Get over it. You want to make something of this video? I'm sorry. Well, I'll let you go.